everybody it is a glorious day here in WA and I am heading down to the beach again I've actually got my swimmers on today even though I'm not going swimming just thought I would pop them on um, so we can take some shots because that's what we do with our lives these days um, <laughs> but no we're going up for a walk along the beach we're taking Taka with us Frederick is eating some broad beans at the moment and we're going to go head down to the beach and meet my friend Megan there. Everyone is in the car. I'm in so I'm in the car, Frederick's in the car and Tiger is all the way back there. Tiger, do you want to say hello? Tiger! No, apparently not. Apparently he doesn't want to say hello. But um yeah, we're going to head to the beach now. So we'll see you guys when we get onto the glorious sand. We actually have the beach to ourselves. It's so nice. There's like one person down there. But it is so nice. I'm waiting for Megan to arrive, but there's like not one inch of wind. No, well, there's like a tiny bit of wind, but like nothing. It's so nice, peaceful down here. The sky is bright blue, there's no clouds in sight, and it's just a beautiful day. <laughs> We're heading off home now. Freddie is wrapped in this little muslin towel wrap thing because he decided he wanted to go for a swim and he got drenched, didn't he? He got soaking wet. So I had to wrap it in this because I forgot to bring a towel because I didn't expect him to go into the water because he's been really afraid of the ocean lately. So I wasn't expecting him to go into the water, but we're heading home. My sunglasses are coming off my face. We're heading home and hopefully this guy now falls asleep and I get to have some me time. We'll just have to see when we get home. We are home now and I just put on a baggy top and I also just put on some leggings just because I want to be comfy for the rest of the day and not that those shorts and the bathing suit aren't comfy because they totally are. I just wanted to be more comfier than what I was. Um, so I just decided to chuck on these clothes. Plus, we're not doing anything for the rest of the day. So I was just like, I don't need to look nice for the rest of the day. I can just look like my normal daggy self. But issue again for today. What are we going to have for lunch? Ugh, I really feel like having junk food. But unfortunately, one, my child's asleep. And two, there is no vegan junk food near me like anywhere so it's really hard to do that so I might just cut up some potatoes and put some potatoes in the oven to cook and then I might cook some vegan sausage rolls there you go easy peasy lime squeezy and then we're gonna have a super duper duper healthy dinner I'm going to make like a vegetable risotto tonight so super 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 healthy dinner not so super healthy lunch even though it is healthy, kind of, not really. No, it's not, Amy, what are you kidding? Don't, don't pretend it's healthy because it's not healthy. I've needed some water for so long. Even better when it's got ice in it. Is anyone like me? And if there's ice in, any ice left, you crush the ice like you eat the ice. I love crushed ice. It's all I did when I was pregnant. Um, and ever since I was pregnant with Frederick, I'm just obsessed with ice. Like, but when I was pregnant with Frederick, I used to take like two cups of ice and just chew on the ice. Like that was my craving throughout my whole impreg pregnancy was just chilling on ice. God, it must have drove Jason insane. Now that Frederick's awake, we can go out and do some stuff. It's like 3.30 and we can finally go out and do some stuff for the rest of the day because he's been sleeping for so long but we're actually going out and we're going to go get our new family member i'm really looking forward to this i hope frederick has fun with our new family member but we're going to go pick up our little new family member 
can't wait to share with you guys what it is and who it is and everything like that but um yes let's go pick out or go get i should say our new family member want to tell everybody what our new family member is our new uh, family member is a plant. We decided to come and get a new plant for our family and I decided to go with this one. I really like the green on it. It's really cute and it's good for indoors. Um, but yeah, we're just at Bunnings looking at all these plants. So because Frederick's not super happy over the plant, I decided I am going to get him a strawberry plant because one, he loves strawberries and two, I think it would be really cute if we had a strawberry plant at home. We actually used to have them but we all ki we killed them. So I am going to get one for him. I'm going to get this one because it's flowering which means the fruit aren't far away. So you want, the, you want your strawberry plant? <gasps> That's more interesting, isn't it? Yeah, look, it's a strawberry. Can you see the strawberry? You're like, yes, I can, but I want to eat it. Leave it, darling, so he can grow. Oh, gee. <laughs> You're going to eat the little unripe strawberry. Oh, no. He's going to be really sour, darling. Oh, no. He's not, he's not yummy, is he? You guys were definitely expecting us to get an animal of some sort. I'm so sorry, but there is no more animals happening in our house because we have way too many already. We've got three. That is enough for us. Plus a toddler. It's insane. So, so no more animals. So everyone who thought that we were going to get a new, new pet, we did. But a plant kind. We just have to keep him alive just the same as an animal, but he's just a plant instead. So, guys, you have to give me suggestions on what to call this guy. Um, he is called a devil's ivy, so I don't know if I should call it devil or should I call it ivy because it's a devil's ivy. I don't know. Or we should call it something else. Let me know. Give me your suggestions about what we should call our new family member. We've got home, our plants are safe, or I should say our new family members are safe and sound at home. We also went to Audi to go get some groceries and I just want to say Rochelle who works at Audi, I know she probably will be watching now that I've been to um, Audi today, but she's actually a subscriber of ours and I've seen her twice now. She works at Audi's and I just want to say thank you again for oh, just being an amazing subscriber and everything. I adore, I adore seeing you now. Like when I go into Audi, I'm like, oh my god, I hope Rochelle's, Rochelle is working and everything. I want to see her and stuff. So it's so nice to like meet subscribers out of, you know, YouTube and not just seeing their names pop up on YouTube and not knowing who they are. Like it's so cool 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 i can't even talk it is so cool to finally like meet subscribers and know like put a face to a picture if that makes sense so like a face to a comment hey, at audi we got these tasty smushed whole food balls these are the peanut and peanut butter and caramel flavor they're vegan look they say vegan on it i didn't even check that was really bad of me got oat milk we got some bread. The last thing we got was this rice. I don't know how to say it. Abrino rice? We'll just go with that. But um, it's rice for a risotto because that is what we're having for tea tonight. And Frederick has just found rubbish that he wants to play with instead of normal <gasps> toys. Because apparently rubbish from on top of the bin is better than rubbish or toys, I should say, on the floor. <laughs> Seriously, what entertains a child? I can't even speak today, guys. What is going on? My camera is not focusing on me either, which is really strange. Come on, camera, focus on my face and not what's behind on me. I still can't talk. What is going on? I took. I just took Frederick's dummy because at the moment we're actually um, transitioning him off it. 
um he had it once today which i was mm, i'm happy about because the last four days he has not had it once um so the last four days he has gone 12 or more hours without it um yesterday was 12 straight hours without it which i was really happy about um today he had it when he had his nap so at about lunchtime he had it and then he found it don't know where he found it um, but he had found it just before we left the house and he's just put it down himself. So I'm going to take it off him and he won't realize that I've taken it off him and he won't get it back until about seven o'clock tonight. So he'll go a few more hours without it, but it's going really well. Day three was horrible. That was the day he had his huge meltdown. It was a horrible day. I cried, 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 cried. I just like cried the whole day. Um, but the last two days have been good. So it's been good. It's going well. I just want to get him off the D-U-M-M-Y. I'm too afraid to say it, but I feel like he knows what it is. Um, but I want to take him off it for Christmas. So he's got eight weeks to get used to not having it. So hopefully by the time Christmas comes, he won't have one anymore. Um, I just don't like the look of it. And I just don't think he really needs it anymore. Plus, I'm really worried about his teeth moving from using it too much so it's getting and getting taken off him i feel like today has been another one of those really chilled days and i feel like i've vlogged the last few days i've been vlogging have been really 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 chilled which is something i'm really enjoying what is going on with my hair i've been really enjoying just having a really laid back vlogs the last few couple of days it's been really nice it's been really easy going for me and I don't have to worry too much um maybe I'll continue to do it maybe you guys would just like to see more laid back you know everyday vlogs instead of me trying to make them perfect because that's what I feel like I've been trying to do lately is making our vlogs perfect and then I stress out way too much but if they're just like normal everyday vlogs where we just stay at home you just see like cute things of Frederick I've been like trying to include Frederick more and more into our vlogs because they're mainly more about for him than for us, really. Um, but yeah, I feel like our vlogs are just becoming really laid back and kind of lazy. But hopefully you guys like that. You'll have to let me know if you guys like seeing these kind of like lazy vlogs. Um, who knows? You might hate them and I might just have to go back to the other things. But I only will find out if you guys tell me if you like these lazy vlogs or the more structured you know crazy editing vlogs i have no idea it's like 4 30 and i still haven't made this bed but that's okay did you bring your broad beans in with you yeah they're yummy what flavor are they again salt and vinegar aren't they yeah these are what he's got at the moment roasted fava beans which are broad broad beans and their salt and vinegar flavor are you gonna share with me can i have one can i have one can i have this one can mommy have one mommy's just gonna steal one anyway thank you put them back in the packet good boy mommy's got it well done uh oh that one didn't go in Got some more there. Oh, well done. You put so many in that time. Well, me and this little guy here are just chilling on our bed, having a casual, I don't know, time before I have to cook tea. I think it is time for us to head off. So we hope you enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. What do you think? A big thumbs up, Freddie? Uh. Oh, that's okay. Oh, just oh, just oh. wipe your food all over my white sheet. <laughs> Maybe hit that subscribe button if you guys want to see more from us. But we will see you guys all tomorrow. Bye. Do you want to say goodbye? Bye. Well done. See you guys.